The Cooperage on Tap, a first-of-its-kind craft beer festival in the northern Pocono Mountains at 1030 Main Street in Honesdale, Pennsylvania. A special thanks goes out to all the vendors and volunteers that came out to make this one of the most amazing and special events of the season. The Cooperage on Tap takes shopping local a step further by pairing craft beer makers with local chefs, restaurants, and products. And the key to any successful event is preparation. So, as all the vendors prep their stations, we got a chance to see everything the Cooperage on Tap had to offer. Plates are prepped, kegs and tables are set, and a sound check brings this all together. the fine details taken care of, the Cooperage on Tap takes off. And as we wait in anticipation, as guests check in, it's not long before there's a line down the block. Each ticket holder receives a tap taster, an ID bracelet, and the Cooperage passport which allows them to keep track of the brew, food, and fare from each local vendor. And we even get a chance to chat with a few brewmasters. So we have four beers today. We have a, what we call a, um, a, a cask, uh, aged bourbon um, porter, which is like really tasty. And then we have a, what uh, we have locally is a Yulin honey wheat, a nice summer beer. We have a, a cider. Um, that, you know, a little bit twist on, um, you know, obviously beer today, but for people who are not liking cider or they're gluten intolerant or whatever, we, we brought the cider along. And then we have um, a, um, uh, a Highland Lager, which is, which is a really nice beer also. And one thing that made Cooper John Tap truly special is the opportunity to hang out with friends and family, try new things, and meet new people. The tap was not only host to new and emerging craft beer vendors, but it also showed support for local agriculture. So we're a small brew pub based out of uh, South Philadelphia. Um, around since February. Uh, we Recently we uh, started growing our own hops up here in Milanville, just outside of Honesdale. And uh, we're just super excited to be here, part of the community. And um, yeah, today's the, uh, the premiere of our beer here in Honesdale. The, the one that we're featuring today is called Wayward Cloud and it's brewed with um, Sour Patch Kids and uh, watermelon puree. And so, so it's nice, tart and fruity and delicious. And if the tastes from the tap weren't enough, the pairing with local restaurants made this a truly signature event. Treats like the barbecue bacon caramelized onion pizza, beer battered corn dogs with honey Dijon mustard, croquettes and mini mac and cheese bites, hops infused products. homemade sausage slider with spelt grain bun, goodies for even gluten-free participants, and for the acquired taste, escargot. There you go, enjoy it. And we round it off with panna cotta with pickled berries and the amazing Mocha Origins organic chocolate fountain. And if you weren't necessarily a beer connoisseur, there's coffee from local vendors, loose leaf tea, local artwork, and music.
traveled through this crowded event? We asked a few participants what they thought. Some great beers here, uh, good food. Um, it's a good thing. I think next year they should make it bigger. I like beer, and all the people that I don't usually get to hang out with are here. I love just having all the interaction with different people. There's um, a lot of different venues here, local, and some that we know very well, and some that we're just newly introduced. Look forward to next year. So, if you missed this year's The Cookridge On Tap, stay tuned for next year and check them out at thecookridgeproject.com.